wrong? Nothing. Then why are you wearing the adventure hat? You only wear that when you're depressed. <sighs> you know... Yes, Susan did in fact know what was bothering Cedric. It was only last week that he had quit his job to pursue his lifelong dream of being a movie critic. Having just made such a big decision, Cedric was now racked with doubt and uncertainty. And yes, this series does have a narrator now. We know it's starting to sound a little like Arrested Development, but just be cool, guys. Be cool. That was kind of a bold move you made there. I'm just... I'm just anxious, you know? I mean, my interview is tonight, and I'm not the best public speaker in the world. You're not the worst public speaker in the world. I was voted that in high school. I'm sure it's nothing. Over 100 people voted me that in high school. Listen, we don't need to freak out here. Let's just review what you need to do. I have to have a good interview with Asian English, and then he'll give me a thumbs up, and then I'll get my big break. Yo, 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 is the gangster say. Late Nights on Skype is an internet talk show hosted by Agent English. If he likes the person he interviews, he'll give their product a thumbs up. Agent English is loved by a large demographic in England, and a thumbs up has been the big break for many people. Cedric hopes to be one of those people. Well, what time's your interview at? Uh, four o'clock, I think. So in ten minutes. Yep. Sweetie, I love you, but you're a fucking idiot. Hello? Cedric the Critic? That's me. <laughs> and you're Agent English? Correct. All right, Cedric, I want a good, clean interview. Let's just get some basics down. First off, I'm going to ask you for your favorite director and why. Then I'll ask you what your favorite film is and why. Oh, and I feel you should know I ingested copious amounts of the delicious narcotic red dandies before logging on. Wait, what? And we're recording. Hello, Internet. My name is Agent English, and this is Late Nights on Skype. Here with me tonight is Cedric Black. Hello, Cedric. Hello. Now, you're new to the movie critic business, aren't you? Correct, Agent English. Now, who's your sexiest director, and why? What? Choose your fragrant director in Sky. Um... Wait! <laughs> Hold on. Did I say Sky? <laughs> yes, it turns out the English didn't watch Late Nights on Skype for the quality of the interviews. Obviously, it's funnier to watch a man with a drug problem try his best to interview people, then a sober man doing the same thing, only with less hilarity. Well, I think it's between Wes Anderson and Christopher Nolan. I mean, Christopher Nolan can never disappoint you, but Wes Anderson always has that th this feel about his films that he just... I met Orson Welles. Orson Welles, you mean? I do this to my buddy because she left me, mother! I think it was a Tuesday I met with Orson. He was leading an intergalactic empire at the time. Had a giant wizard cyborg as his right hand man. Nice bloke. Bit of an air breather though. Uh... Do you want to log off? Maybe? Uh, maybe? We can do this another time. You know, when you're sober. Crap! My hand, it's, it's so big. H how did it get so big? It's like... <laughs> Are you gonna be okay? Cedric the movie critic is the devil. He's Satan. He spews lies and babes puppies. No, I don't. No, I don't. No, I. No, I. D no, I don't. No, I don't at all. Thumbs all around. Kill Fred Dick. Fred Dick, the booby critic, is the devil's loved up slave boy. That. That's. That's not even my name. The walls are communists. The walls, Marxist bastards. This isn't about me at all. This isn't about anyone. At all. This. This isn't anything. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs>
<laughs> Little did Cedric know that, in fact, Agent English's audience loved the interview, as would be evidenced later. Holy shit, I got a job. On the next episode of Critical Times. This is your face. Is, is your face. <laughs>